Hello friends, I'm Colonel Failure, and uh, welcome back to Automation Empire. Uh, last time around, we barely... Well, I say not barely, we... Hello friends, I'm Colonel Failure, and this is Automation Empire, uh, where last time around we deleted the entire factory and, uh, and built it up again. Uh, and this is this is the, uh, the change that we've got. Uh, these trucks are actually filling up quite nicely now, and uh, very rarely do you have a wait like you've got going on now. Not sure why we missed that one, but we did. But that's okay. It's now leaving. So that's all good. Uh, and as a result of this, we are actually making a profit. It's a very, very, very small profit. But it's a profit nonetheless. And I'll take it. Uh, so hopefully, once I've restored uh, transit to these other two truck lines here, we should be, uh, we should be in quite a shiny place. Uh, also, it turns out that... Uh, as much as I was debating whether or not to change the layout to make sure that all of these filled up, don't need to, they all fill up just fine. Uh, the only weakness in the system is that sometimes the grabbers will empty out, you know, one or two of these boxes, uh, which leads to a, a situation where it might pass and there be none waiting. But to be honest, they complete their circuit that quickly and the trucks are so slow to, to, uh, to arrive uh, you'll see, if we watch this first loop here, uh, you'll see that it's going to be a while before there's even another truck in situ. So they're going to be cruising with a full load ready to go. Now, while you were away, I had a look at the claw train gate, because I thought, gate, that's gate, uh, because I thought, you know what, one of those on there, if I were to tell it, wait until there's a truck here before moving out, then potentially your claw train uh, could immediately do a drop-off right at the start of the truck being there, right? Yeah, that's pretty cool, huh? Yeah, it doesn't work. That's that's not what it does. Uh, basically, it will not allow it to pass until it has got a minimum number of crates on board. So what you can do is you can put a stop at the front there when you've got six loading points and say, if you've got fewer than six crates on there, no go for you. Um, useful, but ultimately not as cool as it would as it could be. Uh, waiting for a truck to be in, in the stop would be uh, yeah, actually pretty helpful. So even this longer route, as you can just saw there, is, uh, is having to wait a little while for, for a new truck to turn up. And that will be aided significantly once I get these to flush through once in a while. Let's get that done, shall we? Okay, no no need to, uh, to reinvent the wheel on this front. This system, for as... Uh, yeah, I mean, we could probably work the uh, the minecart system here a little better. Uh, but for as convoluted as this is, it is working and it's getting the job done. So, uh, what we're going to want to do is build this in a, a fairly compact fashion and keep this lot fairly close together. Right? Yes! Yeah, absolutely right. So, we're going to want... Uh, you, oh, I see, I see what you're thinking here. Uh, that's exciting. I think it is exciting because having four sets of uh, of, uh, of mine carts running in parallel is uh, is a joy to behold for for all concerned. Uh, so if we just spin that around that way, oh, how much fun is that? Well, okay, it's a it's a modest amount of fun, but you know, try not to get carried away. There you go. How about that? Yeah. Weird that it's not actually symmetrical. Yeah, it is, isn't it? Ah, okay, hold on, there's a reason for that. And it's because you haven't put it in exactly the same place. Get rid of that one, and that one, and then uh, and then do it properly. If we're going to go for something that is approximately symmetrical, go for something that is actually symmetrical, and that way the, uh, the symmetry fans out there will not feel aggrieved. Uh, right, okay, sucker uppers. We want, uh, we want three on here, yeah. Are those the right ones? They do appear to be the correct ones, yes. Uh, then the same kind of an idea on this. Right, now, you might not like this very much, but uh, let me tell you, right now, you're going to hate what I do next. Uh, so, uh, you know, brace yourselves. I've got an idea. I don't think it's going to work, but uh, that doesn't mean I shouldn't uh, shouldn't entertain the notion anyway and, and give it a spin. Is that right? Yeah, that would be right. Okay, right, cool. Give me that and this. Yeah, good. Smashing. Now this is going to ramp the electric bill up quite a bit. You might think it's uh, it's uh, quite expensive to heat your one-bedroom flat. Well, let me tell you, 
running six of these industrial furnaces. It's a little bit more pricey than that. Uh, but then this is just a video game. Right, sling that on there, put this on here, do a bit of that, one of these, some of that, and a bit of this. And then everybody can, uh, you know, celebrate good times. Come on. Uh, bung this on, uh, on the whatnot at the end here. Yeah, I know, I'm going for exactly the same system. Do you know why I'm going for the exactly the same system? Because the existing system appears to be working. Uh, maybe not brilliantly, but it's certainly working sufficiently. Uh, and that's that's good enough. Why have we? Why did we move those apart again? Oh, it's to, to make room for the, the bend in the track. You could move maybe one square further over. But you know, let's let's not split hairs in that uh, in that regard. Well, I, I I doubt very much this is going to be the last time we uh, we interfere with this system. So you know, let's uh, let's just relax. Um, and I'm also going to want one more to uh, to supply uh, research coal because that's special coal for research purposes. Uh, but we'll do that last. Now, where are you going to put your dustbin for this one? Don't know. Uh, you'll also note that, that we're actually filling up enough in this, uh, this hopper here now to actually keep everybody else kind of topped up. Still not brilliant, though. So I think we might have to work a slightly different... Oh, I've got an idea. And that's always the start of a, of a jolly good adventure. All right, okay, stop that. Yeah. And this. Yeah, right. Good. Take this back. This is... This is not more efficient, is it? No, it's just to get rid of the wiggle coming through there. Right, okay, here's the scheme. Uh, is we're going to run two of these. Yes. We'll put one of them here. For any particular reason. Yeah. And we'll put another one here. Again, I have to ask. What's your, uh, what's your rationale? Now, this is going to be the incoming hopper from that side. Uh, and I am refusing to answer your question. And that's the hopper from the other side there. Uh, and uh, and basically one track will run up to this one. It won't be that one, it'll probably be the other track. Will run up and get served here. The other one will run around the corner and get served there, right? And we can, we can replicate that both ways. And then the input line uh, will bring that up around the top. Right? And then the same from that side as well. Okay, everybody clear? Everybody clear? Yeah, good. Okay, yeah. You know, this is slower than you were doing before. It may well be slower than I was doing before, but I will also uh, do my best in, in terms of uh, uh, trying to top them up a little bit more readily, fluidly, effectively, and so on. All right. Yeah. Okay. So what you've what you've done there is you've you've chosen the wrong one. Uh, you, 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 you want the one that means that it throws it out, not the one that sucks it up. There you go. All right, and then that, and then this. All right, beautiful. Now, here's, a, here's an opportunity for a little bit more symmetry. And remember, symmetry fans are watching. Oh, it would be nice to be able to... No, you can't, though. All right, okay, so you have to go around the corner like that, and then to there. That's gone well. Uh, and then you have to come out of here, go around the corner like that, and then onto there. That's gone well as well. Hey, look. Ah, uh, Hmm? You're not impressed? Yeah, I could have timed, tried to time that so that they were both moving in unison. But I decided not to. Because that was effort. Alright, how are you going to get this over there onto that? Money? Yeah, yeah, yeah you can... Oh, dear. No. No, it's not... That's not going to work. Um, oh, there's a crazy scheme. It's not a crazy scheme. It's a terrible idea. Uh... Also, I don't think it will work. Have a look. No, it's not going to work. Totally isn't going to work. Even with doorways galore, that's not going to fly. Oh, that's a shame. Yeah, it may, well, a shame it may be. Oh, hold on. No, no, no. Wait, 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 wait. All is not lost. All right, get rid of that. Get rid of this. Get rid of that and this. Okay. Just a minor change in plan, nothing too significant. So you sit on there, you sit on here, All right? Means I'm going to need to think a little bit more before bringing these uh, these services in. Also, possibly worth doing that kind of now-ish. Oh, okay. All right. Yeah. 
And so that you don't have to use the hideous wiggler. Yes. I think you're still going to have to use the hideous wiggler. I'm very sorry. Oh. Am I, though? Uh, no, maybe not. Maybe not. Hold on. Right. Ding. Joink. All right. There you go. That's, that's, that's really pinging around now. Getting, uh, getting good value for money from, from, its, uh, from its speedy pingage. All right. You come around like that. Yeah. Okay. And then what? You have to go around in like this. And then something that does uh, like alongside there. Okay, all right. Well, let's let's see what we see what we end up with. Uh, right, where's the next hatch opportunity? I'm not sure this is this is convenient at all, but we're going to do it anyway. All right, go from there, and uh, and then rock this around in here. It's round onto that, yeah, and then rock this underneath there. Oh, double decker minecart. Okay, that's worth the price of admission. Yeah, all right. Yeah, yeah. So, okay, okay. Yeah, all right. I'll allow it. Right. Add another, add another one to this particular hall here, and then lengthen that accordingly. Right. Okay. Right. Well, I should top that one up uh, because it is doing. Uh, and then we stick another. This feels very much like I the, the last episode, doesn't it? So that's nice. Uh, a certain amount of familiarity certainly makes everybody feel at home. Uh, right, sling that on there, sling that on there. Now, you are going to run out of space. <clears throat> so, this two that you're running at the moment might... Uh, you, I mean, as the main thing is, as long as it keeps it all topped up, everything's absolutely keen. So, uh, that's, the, that's the only bit that matters. Yeah, alright. Are you sure this is right? Well, sure is something that none of us can be these days. There you go, that's the stuff. Yeah, I think you're going to need to... Uh, there's, you know, I don't know how you're going to cope with this, to be honest. Uh, oh, okay, you grab some there. That's something, I suppose. Alright, because of the length of time this takes, I don't know how well this is going to work. Uh, but it is doing something. Now, there, the joy of these games is there are a thousand different ways of... Uh, uh, of removing the hide from the feline, and uh, and therefore, you know, you just do what makes you happy. Frankly, this uh, this four-way section of minecart track in the middle makes me pretty flipping happy. I'll tell you that. Right now, stop uh, stop gallivanting. Get the other side hooked back up, and uh, we'll see if we can't get some throughput on this business. Because you've got this is the big dog you've got here. It is a big dog, isn't it? Uh, okay. Right, do you want to turn it around or are we going to loop? I think we're going to, I think we're going to loop. Now, how's that going to work with your hose pipe here? It's going to work brilliantly with the hose pipe here. That's that's how it's going to work. All right, okay. Well, go on then. Uh, right. Yep, we'll do that. Right, that's me on loading section. Then you whiz it around the corner. Wizard around a quarter there, actually, because we know that you can put a door on that bit, and that's important. Straight lines are our friend. Uh, right, okay. Yep, one there. Alright, then run this out here like it means business. Okay, and then... And then run it down here like it also means business, but this time it really does mean business. Okay, uh, yep, yep, okay, this one, thank you. All right, rock that around there to about here, and then rock it around the corner to there. There we go. Wait, they, that's a that's a point to point service. That's fine. You don't need any more than that, surely. Nope. No, I think we're all right. Okay. This is starting to top up now, which is a good sign. Uh, and that's that's coming because you get whenever you get a good backlog of uh, of crates at the furnacing center, uh, it allows the, the the hopper system to actually catch up a little bit. What we're not getting is anything in cart two, and then when we do get stuff in cart two, it gets hijacked by one of these first two hoses. Oh no, there we go. We, we slung some in that one. No, okay, that's that's all largely working. Now you should have turned up by now. Oh, here we go. Right. Uh, oh, you're going to need a little bit more overspill than that, aren't you? Right. Let's let's give you maximum overspill for the moment, and then uh, that's not even enough. No, even that's not enough. Yeah, one short. Okay. Or, there is another way of looking at it, which is remove one of the minecarts from there. Okay. 
Maybe two. Okay. Now, I mean, that's only going to remain full because both of these are full at the moment. So, you know, I wouldn't, uh, I wouldn't stress too much about that. Uh, you can take a couple of bits off the end there. That's probably enough. Is there a faster loop that can be done here? Not unless you do another one of those kind of micro point-to-point -point efforts that you've got on the other side. So, so don't uh, don't worry yourself about that. Yeah, okay. I think this is actually the more efficient system uh, at the uh, at the time of speaking. Right. Okay. With that in motion, we can now turn our attention to uh, getting the getting the track built. Now, are you going to be the close one? You're going to be the close one. All right. So you want to go like uh, build the door. Okay, what's the betting the door won't actually fit there? Oh, for the love of all things lovable. Okay, well, go out that one. Yeah, and then come back in the other one. And don't don't stop there. You're going to want a lot of doors here, so they're you know, getting plumbed in now. All right, okay, fine. Yeah, now, give me the bent bit here. Yes. And then stick another one there. Yes. And then, uh, and then go to town. Alright. Now, the good news is, this has to be done on a loop, otherwise it doesn't work properly. So, hooray! Because loops are cool. Alright, uh, let's stick that there. Whoa, 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 whoa. No, no, there, there. Oh, missed it. Alright, uh, right, there you are. And again. You're just making noises now, man. You're not even, you're not even trying to speak English, and people really approve of of it being in a language that they have some semblance of understanding even those for whom English is not their first spoken language they can get a basic idea of what you're on about oh, well I would counter that with uh, just the random noises possibly translate a little bit better into uh, into languages not my own yeah alright yeah you see because uh, yeah, your, your middle aged bloke sounds rather similar no matter what country he's from in the sense that you can no longer form a completely coherent sentence. So, shut up. Uh, right. Do I need that level of overspill based on this one? Yes. You sure? I'm not sure you do. I think you can delete the end off that. I don't think you can. Alright, we'll put the put the picker-uppers on. And then we'll, uh, then we'll work from there. Uh, right, picker-uppers. This is this is just you know, this is the profit train waiting to happen here. If I get rid of that end piece, yeah, you can. All right. Not that it's going to make a vast amount of difference, you understand. But you know, if there is a shorter route to take, once in a while I'll take it. Most of the time I won't. Uh, right, bung some bung some claws. Get to work there, lads. Groovy. But we are we're in motion. Look, motion is occurring. And uh, and long may it mosh. Also, have you done that right? I have. Well, that's bizarre. That's that's not what we've come to expect at all. You know, just just randomly pick crates up there, lads. It doesn't really matter. And Dropski. And an extra an extra truckload of profit sails off into the sunset, which is uh, deliriously wonderful. Good. Now, the other thing that I could do here is I could set up a 12 to work off a separate furnace system that drops off into a, a, a loading hatch bay kind of deal that is then picked up either by a second set of claws. Oh, wouldn't that be fun? Uh, to be transported onto more trucks. Because certainly I've got, I've got enough processing space in here for another, uh, another furnace chain, which is good. Small note, uh, you still need to do your, your research uh, setup. Ah, that's uh, easy. That's child's play compared to what I've been doing lately. Okay, well, several people would say that what you've been doing lately is child's play. Yeah, but I'd be wrong, wouldn't they? Okay, now then, let's uh, whiz this down over here. Talk about there. Uh, fling this over the top of them. Yep. All right, good. And then uh, send this off sideways. And uh, you've got to build a sideways bit. You can you can tell it to go sideways. Once you've got it, once you're doing a drag on a straight line, telling it to go sideways is not a problem. But uh, getting to go sideways when it's going forwards, uh, it's, it's just not meant to be. Uh, 
goes against nature. Right, grab this one and whap it on there. Grab this one. That's too long. Shorten it up one. Nope. Doesn't want to shorten up one. But the one on the other side did. Yeah, well, that's the one on the other side. If the one on the other side jumped off a cliff, would you follow it? That's hardly pertinent. Uh, right, okay, get this round here. Uh, yep, yeah, nope. There. Alright, we're coming in like that. Yeah, that's... Uh, I think there are I think there are great efficiencies to be had in this claw train system, uh, but I also think that it's not going to matter. So, uh, Yabu sucks to you, or thereabouts. Go on, you'll get on there. That's it. This one comes around like this. Uh, well, it comes around like there, and it comes around like this. It goes over there. Making the whole thing a street furniture nightmare. Good. All right, you. Six, please. There you go. Trot on. Now, I wonder whether seven would be a good idea. Oh, seven, you say? Yeah. Now, the reason I think that is that once in a while you leave, like, one space. And therefore, by having a seventh one on there, you would fill that one space. Yeah, but surely you're only leaving one space because you couldn't quite manage to get six on there. Ah, that's what they want you to believe. Well, I don't... I'm having a very hard time following your logic, but I'm going to do it anyway, because uh, part of me thinks, yeah, actually, that, that might not be a terrible idea. Another part of me goes, I don't think it's actually going to make any difference. So, uh, you know, who's to say who's right? There we go. Claws upgraded. Right, there we go. This is a lot of claw action now. I mean, like, just... I mean, like, lots of claws. Uh, and what we should no longer be seeing ever at any point is trucks le le uh, leaving uh, without a full load. Shouldn't ever see it. None of you people had best mess with me. Uh, for doing so is, is likely hazardous to your health. Uh, it's all good. It's all good. Right, let's check the profits. 212, yeah, versus 160. Good. Now, the real test is going to be whether, in fact, all of this faffing around with claw trains has increased our output at all. Yes. Now, given the speed at which they load these trucks up, it must do. Uh, but, I mean, it, the, the, the amount we're actually outputting, or capable of outputting, hasn't changed. So, uh, you know, that's... some. It, yes, might have made a difference, but probably hasn't. Or could have done, and so forth. Right, okay, that's us up to 320. Right, last job for today is to uh, is to get the smeltery up for the uh, refinery again. Okay, uh, and we'll do this in a relatively simple fashion. Uh, you, you sure about that? You and simple fashion are not things that people tend to think of in the same sentence. Uh, right, okay, so we want a door for this thing to entrance through. Hello! Uh, and then uh, down you come. Will you down you come through there? No, uh, you need to come through a little bit first. Okay, up to height level two, please. All right, come through about to there. And then uh, will you? Uh, will will one descend? Only if you select the right height level. One is descending. Okay, now we're only rocking one truck on here, so we can do something that that services one truck only. Uh, the only thing I want is to be able to grab it out of. The, uh, the main... I mean, basically, we're going to hijack resources as they come in. Uh, so we'll do that, and then we'll do a boxer-upper. Yeah. Okay. Yep. One times boxer-upper, one times furnace, and then one times look and go, oh, I'm going to have to move that over. <clears throat> so then you move it all over and do it again, but better. Uh, in fact, let's let's pull our U-turn that we need at the first uh, section. So something like that, something like this. Go on, go on. There you go. Right, that's where it's got to be. And then also, you can't use a pipe. You're going to have to use a mine. This is a mine cart. Yes, yes, I know it's a mine cart. I can't remember how I did it. All right, well, go check. Thought that ain't it. 
Well, how am I? Where's the where's the bit where I'm refining stuff to send to the? Oh, you okay? It's down at the far end. I forgot that this one existed. Uh, you're doing that, which is then output onto a conveyor, which is then sucked up into a hopper, which is then spewed out onto a minecart. Ah, oh, flipping heck. Well, though, flipping heck notwithstanding, that's how it's got to be. All right, well, I've got, I've got a metric ton of space, so uh, yeah, we'll, we'll just we'll, we'll do it that way. All right, okay, so the system remains largely the same. Uh, a sucker-upper is the first job. Yes, that then, well, no, because you've got it facing the wrong way. Uh, that's the first job. Spin it around. Well done. And then add it to the crate maker. Mmm, so good. Makes the crates. Then put the refiner on the end. Oh, tasty. Turning it into something that is refined, rather like myself. And then, flipping egg. And then, shut up. Uh, you put in a bit of this. Oh, delightful. Uh, followed by some kind of hazardy bunkery sucker up kind of a deal. Uh, so one of these. Oh, gosh, that's amazing. Isn't it, though? Uh, and then you have uh, another sucker up, because uh, that's a thing. Yeah, okay. Make sure it's facing the right way now. Yeah, what? It only connects to that. Alright, oh, don't, don't, don't wait. Wait, remain calm. I think we might need it there, though. We might need a little bit of extra space. Don't just chuck that. Oh, never mind. No, 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 no it's alright. No, I'll fix it. And then, make it the right length. Very good. Uh, before sticking your unload station right next to it and telling them to throw everything away. Like a piece of rubbish. Uh, fill up the tank. Oh, you're going to. This is just going to intercept absolutely everything in the short term. Uh, but it's going to be fine. Uh, and then, take that yes, and fling it onto there, which you have. You came really close to lining this up correctly, but ultimately, you didn't. Oh, no. But that's okay. No, it's not okay. Trust me, it's not going to work. Oh, we can wiggle that one over one. I know it's horrible, but it's less horrible than having to do it with my track. Okay. Uh, stick that there. Yeah. To move this one and that one, right. and this one and that one, and probably that one as well. <sighs> you know, I, you know, I live by uh, measure once, cut once, bulldoze everything. Uh, but you know, sometimes you can't help but thinking, why don't you measure twice? And you kind of go, nah, that'll never catch on. And you kind of go, no, I swear, I swear that was the original. The, the original policy was to uh, to measure things twice, uh, purely to avoid having to cut it at all. Frankly, right? Okay, are you now operational? Hoover, why you know Hoover? I don't. I think we're not Hoovering because we've got nowhere to go with it. All right, I'm not convinced by that, but I'll, I'll allow it. Uh, do we want one, two, one, possibly two, one? Okay, we don't need two. Two would be excessive. It is It was. Is more than we need. Right, buy one of those. That's it. And presto. And tell this to destroy everything. Yeah. Now, why are you not behaving... Oh, has any? No, that's fine. What's your problem? Transfer tube. Off, on. Go. Transfer. With your tube. Transfer tube. Transfer tube. Hello. What appears to be your major malfunction there, sailor? Alright, just keep throwing stuff away until it decides to get with the program. Transfer tube. No transfer tube. It's the right transfer tube. I know, that's a first, but it is. What's the... what's the... I, I don't understand. Why are you not working? What have I done wrong? Because obviously I have done something wrong, otherwise this would be working. Yes? Alright, go look at the working one again, and just make sure you haven't missed anything robust and obvious. I'm, I'm pretty certain I haven't missed anything. No, see, look, the crate turns up, this goes very much. Like that, right? And then throws the crate away. Yeah. Okay, that's weird. 
Uh, no, that is, that's genuinely weird. That should be working. You should be, oh, hold on. We are working. It's got some now. Right, okay, throw that away. All right, mate, it just needed a, needed a moment or two to reread the manual uh, before, uh, before getting to work. Okay, fine. Groovy. That's it. There we go. That's all working again. Okay, I've got an absolute ton of research in the bank, and that's about to go up. Yeah, let's just claim all of this. Uh, so, at the start of the next episode, we shall review what the uh, what the next research agenda piece is, and work our way towards that. Uh, we do have the option to uh, to go flipping egg. Is that the balance? How much have I made? Uh, Two eight six versus one seven eight. Okay, well, I think that's a successful test then. Uh, using the claw train approach has radically improved my throughput. Hooray for me and all who sail in me. In fact, we might even just buy this now to celebrate. And also, claw trains, you can go faster too. Hooray for you. Uh, drones, get knotted. Uh, I've been Colonel Failure. Thank you very much for watching. Uh, I'll be back soon with uh, more. Uh, we're going to work towards trains. I think that's the that's the easy answer. We don't even. I said we were going to do it next time. We're not. We're going to do it this time. Uh, but next time, steel plates. Oh God. Oh no. And gold. Oh, flipping heck. And that means we've got to get the uh, the unlock combiner. Oh, which needs six thousand. We're really close to that. We are really close to that. So we're at five eight. Oh, a couple more trucks leaving now, and we pass the six thousand. I don't think we're going to make it. It's going to be flipping close. We've made it. Woohoo! All right, the combiner is next on the agenda. I'm pretty sure it's going to make me cry. Be sure to tune in for that, and in order to make sure you don't miss out on it, you're going to want to subscribe, because subscribe is what real heroes of the revolution would do, if they could. Uh, but they're too busy being revolutionary, so, so often they don't bother. Uh, but maybe you could do it in their place and ensure that the revolution remains strong. I've been Colonel Failure. I'll catch up with you soon. Thanks for watching. Cheerio.